Hi, and welcome to the very first edition of Behind the Pixels, a little small series I'm going to be doing that's showing you behind the scenes of the game that I'll be making from scratch to finish. I will be revealing countless things throughout the weeks to come, and you'll see everything until the game is finished, pretty much. So it's going to be a long, long ride. I am your host, Rittler Games. Since this is the first episode of the series, I'm going to be sharing very little knowledge about the game that I am making. In future videos, I will be revealing more content such as story, art, gameplay, characters, etc. But for now, let's begin with the basics. Inspiration. Now, if you're asked anybody who is somebody in the gaming industry, where do you get your inspiration from? They might say things like Mega Man, Tetris, Metal Gear, Resident Evil. We all get inspired by something or someone in the industry. We often think of it as a way to help us get by in our careers. We feel like if we could be better in their shoes, if we could be them in their shoes, to see what it is like on their day-to-day -day basis, then maybe, just maybe one day, we will be saying the same to somebody else. For my inspiration, it comes from a variety of things, from movies, to games, to people, to real life events, and even from the earth itself at times. I feel I can make a game that people can relate to. People that can relate to characters as, as, as if they were real. Someone who had a good life, bad life, people love to be related to rather than it's real or it's fiction. The only way to get the audience's attention is if you are the audience. My inspiration is creating something great, something meaningful, something delightful, something beautiful. 